Okay, the next one is all yours. Here we go. Go for it. What? Uh, opening it up. And read the title. Don't fart into the Samsung mic. Samsung is crap. <laughs> <laughs> That's what, it, that's what I read. No, actually read the... Okay, Jay, read the title. Samsung, Samsung has released a new Tinder-like dating app with one unique twist. The pictures show the insides of the user's refrigerator. Yo, Samsung is really getting bored of their life. So, can you just imagine <sighs> that they only made this app because of the refrigerator that they made? A $4,000 refrigerator with a touchscreen door. What is no. the world coming to these days? No, no, no. Listen, no. Listen here. No, listen here. Go for it. This is what I think. This is what I think about Samsung. This is what I think about Samsung. Mm -hmm. They make they make great phones and TVs and stuff. They do. But refrigerate this thing is rather just leave it to the professionals. Yeah, I like high sense. <laughs> exactly. We got high sense. Yeah, we have to. <laughs> God, no, look at we we would like okay. Sam oh my god! Samsung fridges. I think the thing about it is like it's honestly really good size, and it does have great cooling and stuff like that, and antifreeze and whatever like that. But the problem is the price, man. Like, who's gonna pay four thousand dollars for a fridge just so you can touch the door to see who's uh your Tinder, based on a fridge? Like, oh my word. Like this literally, really what hurts. happens if you just have sources inside your fridge? Who the hell are you going to match I up with? I just clicked on one of the links, dating where the inside is all that counts. Oh wow. Five courses of love. Um, Family and hub. If, oh my if you, god, if you, what is this? If you scroll down from the actual <laughs> Samsung fridge, you know, there's a, you'll a see... website called Family Hub. Uh, no, and I'm not going to look at it. <laughs> but yeah, that's... <laughs> That's oh, that, that. That's. I feel like that's a weird one because why the heck are you going to well, try to explain the No, why are you gonna try to find someone you could spend the rest of your life with based on a fridge pick? You can always tell everything about a person by what about the contents of their fridge. You can always tell someone based on what their bank account is. <laughs> True, very true. That's very true. Okay, so Jay, I do believe that the next one is yours. But before I go with that, um, have you guys heard of Soldier Boy? I have only, only heard of it today. What is it? Uh, how about you, Horizon? Soldier Boy, no honey, yo. Okay, so you have. Okay, so Soldier Boy is a rapper. Um, and he created this whole. Soldier Boy? Yeah, that he... song. Yeah, no, no, he's he's a rapper and he made songs and whatever, whatever. And he made this whole, like, website based around um, fake Apple Watches and fake Beats and fake hoverboards and all of those type of things. Um, and, I w uh, Jay, you actually know this, but um, you, you actually know that I went to try to find the site so we could look at it. But uh, actually, the site got hacked by one of his camera guys, and wow. now it's shut down. But even better, I'm actually gonna Google this because if you guys go and just um, Google Soldier Boy S O U L J A, you will actually see that seven hours ago there is a fight with Jake Paul and it's happening for real. And 21 hours ago, there's a police search uh, Soldier Boy's house after kidnapping claim. Ah. So, did he kidnap someone? <laughs> no, I'll tell you what happened. Go he for it. kidnapped the... Jake Paul, and then they got into a fight. Oh my gosh. Jay, I think your volume just went completely down. Okay, no, no, now it's better. Now it's better. Okay, yeah, but basically that's that's Soldier Boy, guys. That's basically what I just wanted to mention. But I actually saw his site, and there was like, okay, so you guys know how how expensive Apple Watches I'm is. I'm so gonna US. disconnect. Please don't. <laughs> Come on, man. It's actually starting to get in. I'm gonna have to disconnect. Why? Well, okay, just mute yourself. <laughs> 
He doesn't sound like he's muting himself. Huh? Yeah, he sounds like he's typing something. Yeah, okay, but you and I will have a conversation so long. Basically, um, I, I saw the said, you, you know how expensive Apple Watches are in the US? Uh, yeah. They're, they're at least a hundred dollars or more. Huh. He was selling uh, Apple Watches for like twenty bucks, twenty dollars. Props to the man. N- no, not props to the man because props to the man meant is why are you typing, H? Horizon, why are you typing? I see it in the bottom. Not, not even props to the guy because. Um, Okay, yeah, you, you do that so long. Uh, he's gonna disconnect because his connection, whatever. He might reconnect soon. Okay. But, um, okay. I don't actually... Why did you guys join the PUBG Discord? Huh. There's literally a Discord voice chat for normal chats. Does it really matter? I always figured it was okay. You know what? That's true. Clyde, why, what are you sending to me? Hello, beep boop. If you want to invite friends to the server, click on the server. I do not care. Discord, don't tell me. Discord is telling me how to use Discord. Wow, that is insulting. It is very insulting. Okay, you're going to take the next topic so long. Oh my god, is that you? Yeah, that was my phone. Oh my god, jeez, dude. You don't understand. My headsets are like so loud right now. I'm actually going to drop the volume a bit. Because, gosh dang, that is so loud. Okay, that's better. The team's voice check, voice connection was on one bar. How is that possible? Yes. He was on, his voice connection was on one bar. Yeah, the same thing happened to him yesterday. Maybe he's got too many things running in the background. That's taking up his uh, connection. Yeah. 